Hello everybody, um, the lighting is very bad because it's also getting very dark here but I just wanted to show you um, the seeds that I put in last week is that how you say it? anyways um, they already growing, look at this oh my god this makes me so happy don't mind the puzzle but oh, so cute, my little baby just came back from the gym and treated myself with some iced coffee please. and I just wanted to show you what I thrifted yesterday actually on Saturday yes it was Sunday and I just found some pieces that are absolutely cute and I'm so happy that I found them that I just wanted to share them with you and anyways let me show them to you so first, the first piece that I got is this blouse, which is really, really cute in my opinion. And I hope you like it too. Um, yeah, it's this one. It's 100% cotton, which I really appreciate. And it's kind of transparent, but I love to put on some beige bra underneath so you can't really see it underneath. And yeah, this is the one. Then we got this absolutely cute blue coat. I was looking for a blue coat, well, actually since last year. It looks like that. On the back it looks like this. And yeah, these are the pieces that I um, thrifted on Saturday. And then I thrifted a dress and I fell in love with that dress. I'm, I just put it on and I'm going to show you the picture and it is so cute so yeah this is the dress let me show it to you and yeah i'm really really grateful and now i'm craving some kale pasta so let's cook together In the meantime that I'm cutting the kale, putting them in the water so it can boil. Anyways, I just wanted to tell you that I went to the hairdress in Istanbul and I really regretted it because <clears throat> the guy that first had to do my hair, um, his family was affected by the earthquake so he couldn't do it, which is comprehensible. And <clears throat> So we went in and there was this other guy which offered to do my hair and I'm very, I'm kind of, a, I'm 
very sensitive regarding my hair so I just wanted to look on his Instagram so I can see his work what he's what he has done um, etc etc especially as I wanted to go more well blonde and I showed him a picture what I wanted because I think that's the most effective way to show your hairdresser what you want because like that he or her um, can see what color etc and the tone if you want it warmer beige or ashier so yeah um when i did my hair he was really rough really really rough and i'm kind of shy and couldn't tell anything but my cousin she spoke for me and told him like um, you're hurting her can you be more gentle with her so it didn't really start really good so and in the end my hair was really 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 ashy if i see a picture i'm just going to show you it was really really ashy it was like of a gray to me or silver a lot of people told me it's really beautiful but to me it wasn't and i hated it so much because i love like the goldish beige golden like the honey tone so yeah i was really unhappy and my hair got so damaged and he was wasn't gentle at all and when your hair is already like in general you're gentle with the hair so yeah my hair is really damaged and i went to the hairdresser here in switzerland in aveda and they saved my well it's really dramatically especially i feel so bad because there was the earthquake and that's why i didn't want to talk about it because there's other problems on the earth let me just change perspective anyways as i was telling you um my hair got really really damaged and i went to the Aveda and they helped me with my hair they um took out the grayish silver tone out um put some all effects in it to repair my hair they were so gentle i love them so much and then they put in a gold tone a pure gold tone and it's still like it isn't bad as bad as it was it will it isn't as ashy anymore but it is so difficult to get it out but i'm so much happier and i cut like this much just to a more healthy haircut and it is still really damaged so i'm just going to take care of my hair i also got a, uh, a mask from aveda i'm just going to show you which one i got and it sounds really nasty but i'm washing my hair well before i wash it like once or twice maximum per week and now i'm like waiting eight to nine days that doesn't mean that i sh don't shower daily but I don't wash my hair and that's the ninth day today and I'm just going to wash my hair uh, but yeah I just wanted to give you a, a quick update about my hair and yeah so let's continue cooking <laughs> 